always do use the internet just as like anyone else because the internet is for everyone to use. Hello, my name is Eric Sheptak. I'm 41 years old and I am a homeless, homeless advocate. After my biological parents almost killed me at the age of eight months by fracturing my skull, I went into foster care for almost five years and, and then got taken in by the Shep Talks. They had seven biological children and adopted 30. And I grew up in a large mansion in New Jersey. And it's actually uh, rather ironic that I would go from growing up in a mansion to actually being homeless. Anyone can become homeless. Here, here in D.C., the, the, the uh, population of, of the city is about 600,000 people. And presently there are about six, uh, there are over 6,000, almost 7,000 homeless people. D.C. has the record of having the most homeless people per square foot of any city in the country. Every morning, I, I get up at CCNV, the, the Community for Creative Nonviolence, which is the shelter where I stay, and I'll get dressed and ready to go, and then uh, if I don't have money, then I'll walk up, up to Thrive DC. If I have money, then I'll ride the bus or subway up to Thrive DC, where they feed the homeless and also have other services for the homeless. That's about four miles away. And I'll eat breakfast. And after eating breakfast, I'll, I'll leave and, and go to the library in order to log on to the computer. And then after several hours being at the library, I will go back over to the shelter to eat dinner. And if it's a Monday, Wednesday or Thursday and the library is open late, then I may go back and, and do some more work on the computer because I have a Facebook page as well as a Twitter account and I do a lot of email and uh, I also have two blogs. And then after, after the library closes in the evening, I may go over to McDonald's and, and get me something to eat and then I'll go in and, and lie down for the night. I began using computers about four years ago as part of my work with the Committee to Save Franklin Shelter. With a total of about 17 minutes worth of instruction, I was able to learn how to, how to do email. And, and since then, uh, in my email, I, I have like 1,500 contacts. Uh, Facebook, I have over 4,200 uh, friends. Twitter, I have over 750 followers. I also have two blogs. The reason that I blog is, is so, so that I can do some public education on the issue of homelessness. I put a lot of effort into defeating stereotypes and letting everyone know that, that homelessness is an economic status, that it, it, it doesn't mean that you're stupid, it doesn't mean that you're an addict. It, it just means that, that you're down on your luck. And, and it, it, it is empowering in, in, in the sense that it enables me to teach the general public about the root causes of homelessness and about possible solutions. And, and uh, so that, that's why I, I do as much blogging as I do. It's my hope that, that I can blog my way to revolutionary change until, until housing is, is decommodified and, and is, is not seen as a commodity of which to make profit, but rather as a necessity that's, which is afforded to everyone.